Today, guys, we're going to be checking out some of the best workshop skins in CSGO as of December 2020. Let's jump into it. All right, anyways, guys, the first skin we're going to be checking out today is the PP Bazone Old Gumball Machine V2 3D Effect. So look at this skin right here and tell me that this doesn't look sick. So basically, to sum it up, it's essentially a red PP Bison with a cool little like with some cool accents, obviously, right here. Then there's insert coin. And then there's a lot of like little Easter eggs pointing to the fact that this is a gumball machine. And then, of course, the mag is actually a bunch of gumballs. Literally, this is actually like this is honestly a really cool design. And the fact that this looks 3D in game makes it even better. If they added to this skin tomorrow, dude, I would pick it up because this is hilarious and it's also really cool at the same time. Speaking of which, now we have a word from our sponsor, Go Cases. This video is sponsored by Go Cases, an app on Android where you can get CSGO skins absolutely free. You complete simple tasks, earn coins, and open the cases where you're guaranteed a skin every single time. Sometimes you get good skins, sometimes it's bad skins, but, but I mean, that's every case opening in a nutshell. The most important thing is that you get a skin every single time and it's 100% free. And yes, the skins can be withdrawn directly to Steam. Use my code TMZ to get some coins and good luck unboxing yourself some free skins. Anyways, next skin. Alright ladies and gentlemen, next up we have the Op Print Stream. And you guys know the Deagle Print Stream. Well, this is the op version. And in my opinion, I think this would probably be one of the best ops in the game because it's kind of like an off-white op, basically. It's just black and white with some, obviously it is pearlescent and there are a couple different colors, but for the most part, it's just black and white and it's an amazing design. And honestly, I'm almost confident that they're going to add this to the game eventually because obviously they've released like multiple Neo Noirs, they've released multiple Asimovs, Hyper Beasts. And since the Print Stream is a really popular Deagle, I don't see why they wouldn't add the op version because like this would be it, this would be amazing to use in games so overall ladies and gentlemen would i recommend it do of course hell yeah dude i would love to see it in the game okay here we go next up we have the deagle universe and um this is a picture of it in game and what can i say if you have a purple or a blue themed inventory this would be the rolls royce this would be the cream of the crop this would be the best deagle you could possibly ask for it's a universe it, i don't know it's kind of like you you basically have space back here and then you have for whatever reason, I guess there's like a galaxy right here just chilling. And then of course there's also a whale. I don't I don't really understand the whale because I don't think there's space whales, but it might just be going over my head. And then of course you have like a little constellation and it looks like well, I guess it's just the deagle or whatever. I don't know. This is the angle you'd see if you're trying to I'm not gonna have to throw that in there. Overall, guys, I actually think this skin is incredible, and I would I would definitely use this as my main play skin, definitely with the Pandora's boxes, because this is some top tier deagle action right here, boys. All right, and yes, I'd recommend it. I'd love to see it in the next case. Next up, we have the Glock Jade Dragon, and this is kind of a weird skin because I guess a lot of the pictures are in the dark, and I guess it, it's kind of cool. It has like a little pearlescent effect a little bit. Of course, it has a peace sign, and then there's like a weird kind of effect with a dragon, of course. But then in actual good lighting, the skin looks way different. And I wonder if there's any gifts of this in game. I don't think so, because I, I personally don't know if this is pearlescent or not. So like all I can really do is kind of speculate. Like right here, kind of looks like this. But then when you look at it at this angle, it turns a little more greenish. I'm thinking, number one, either it's pattern based where the skin can just be a different color depending on which one it is, or it could just be pearlescent where depending on the angle, the colors change slightly, which honestly would make this probably one of the coolest skins in the game. Like the only way to really know for sure if it's pearlescent is if there's a GIF. So for the person who made uh, the Jade Dragon or KAS, if this is pearlescent, please try to make a GIF of you inspecting the skin in game so we can kind of see the effect. And if, if not, then it doesn't really matter. But honestly, whether it's pearlescent or not, I still think this is a cool skin and I would like to see it in the, in the next case. Next skin. Next up, ladies and gentlemen, we have the USPS. Next up. <laughs> <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, next up is the USPS Diamond. And this next up, ladies and gentlemen, is <laughs> next up. <laughs> <laughs> Next up, ladies and gentlemen, we have the USPS Diamond. And okay, in my opinion, this skin looks it looks kind of cool, obviously, with like the red and the purple. You haven't seen like I, I personally haven't seen another skin like this before with these specific colors. But then it also has a, an incredibly white version of white. This is basically so it's like a white out mixed with like, I don't even know, like a red 
purple skin. It's it's weird. But I feel like if these details, if this white was a little bit darker or if it was more gray, I think it would look a little bit better. Or even if it was black or any other color, I just feel like the white doesn't really match it too well. And it, I mean, it's a cool skin overall, but I don't think I would personally like this skin. Like I personally probably wouldn't use it in game. So I'm going to say no thanks, not interested. Next skin. Next up, we have the M4A4 Tropic Camo. And the GIF is really small, but I'll try to zoom it in. But basically, this is a pattern based skin that looks kind of cool, actually. So it's pink and then it's kind of like green camo, both mixed together. And of course, every single one looks a little bit different, as you guys can see in these GIFs. Overall, I mean, the color scheme is a little weird, but I still think it's kind of cool. But personally, I don't know. I don't. I'm not the biggest fan of this skin personally, just because I, I just don't really like the way it looks in terms of the colors. So I'm going to say no thanks, not interested. Next skin again. God, what is this? All right, now we have the R8 Revolver Lotus, and this is another pattern based skin. It's basically an R8 Revolver, and it has, I guess, a bunch, it has like a giraffe pattern to it. And then, of course, you can get the rare star pattern. Ooh. Or I guess it's, it might be an atom or something. I, I have no idea, dude. Yeah, it looks pretty fat. So I'm assuming this is the factory new version. And then, of course, this is the battle scarred version. So it does get pretty scratched up. But honestly, this is another skin that I don't really vibe with too, too much. So I'm going to say not interested in this one. It just honestly has kind of an ugly color scheme. And it just it doesn't look that good, in my opinion. My next skin. Oh, OK. You know what? You know what? This one's all right. This this skin is all right because this is the Tech 9 Night Sky. All right. And look at this right here. I wonder if it's pattern based. It might be or it might not be. I don't know. Oh, yeah, it is. Yep. 100%. This is pattern based. So basically, it's a just a regular Tech 9 with some blue. And of course, there's stars on it. So it's basically like the night sky. Now, the cool thing would be, what if there was a rare pattern where you could get like just all black and stars? So it's basically like a night sky instead of like a uh, like like a day, day sky or whatever. And wow. Okay. Never mind. They just answered my question right here, but it also might be based on the conditions. So this is probably the factory new version where it's basically like, you know, there's blue, there's the stars. And then over here by the edge, it gets a little bit darker. So it's kind of like more like nighttime. And then when you actually go battle scarred, which I'm going to assume that this is battle scarred and it looks more, you know, nighttimey kind of. So in my opinion, I actually kind of, I would prefer to use this skin in battle scarred. Just because, I mean, if you're going to see the stars, you might as well have it actually look like the sky instead of like some weird illusion where it's daytime, but you can still see the stars. Like what, what planet are we on? Like Mercury, bro. But I think this is kind of a cool skin. I would definitely love to see it in the next case. Next skin. Guys, we're going to do a couple more. So next up, we have the AK-47 Endorphin. So basically, it's a neon themed AK that's more bluish. So basically, it has a white tip. Then there's some aquamarine right here. Down here is a little bit, it's like pinkish red. And then of course there's nice neon pink right here. There's just like a, I guess it's like a triangle with some black down here. And overall, there's some pretty cool details and it's it's obviously a really colorful and dope skin. And this is how it looks in game. It also has some cool little details right here, which is awesome. And overall, pretty top tier. And then of course, as it gets more battle scarred, it gets really scratched up. But these in fact renew would look absolutely amazing. So I'm gonna say yes. And ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna do one more. And ladies and gentlemen, for the last skin, we have an old but gold skin. We have the Op Danny from 2014. All the other skins that the creator made are just completely gone. If you click on it, it's just, it's, they just don't exist anymore. So this is the last skin basically created by Chemo Dan. And basically, all right, anyways, guys, so this is the Op Danny. And it's kind of a weird skin. Basically, it's just a cartoon op essentially and but this was made in 2014 back when there weren't that many like you know skins like this back when there weren't that many cartoon skins and honestly i don't think they would actually add this to the game but i just wanted to check it out because it's just kind of a cool skin it's something that you wouldn't really expect it kind of looks like i don't know it looks like god you can't even get a good image of it there we go here's here's the inspect of it and um yeah as you guys can see okay so of course you have some clouds up here you have some weird colors over here you have like a freaking emoji or whatever and then over here there's a, a bunch of gingers I, I don't know what's going on dude and then over by the back of it of course you have these people down here you have the word danny right here and then of course you have some plants and then there's water too. So overall, there's a lot happening here. It's kind of like an acid trip in the form of a skin, but honestly, I would actually kind of like to see this in the game. So I'm going to say yes, but I genuinely don't think this will ever make it to the game because I feel like it doesn't really appeal to that many people, mainly because it has the guy's name on it. And also it might be a little bit too colorful. So 
anyways ladies and gentlemen that was my video for the best workshop skins as of december 2020 uh let me know what you guys thought about all the workshop skins we checked out and if you guys want to see more videos like this one hit that like button of course check uh, join our discord server follow me on twitch but overall guys thank you so much for watching hope you guys have a fantastic rest of your day i'll see you guys in the discord i'll see you guys on twitter and i will see you guys in the next one so thank you guys so much for watching it's turbo and i'm out and massive thank you to go cases for sponsoring today's video peace <laughs>